Saki's newly developed unique inspection technology assures measurement performance and data reliability in M2M connection. Saki's AOI and quality-driven production are major components to the success of the Smart Factory. Welcome to the Saki booth here at Productronica. I'm joined by Yaroslav Neuhauser, who's the Deputy General Manager uh, for Europe. Welcome, Yaroslav. Hello, Trevor. Nice to, nice to meet you, and I'm happy to step by here. Great. So, you've got some fairly new stuff here on the booth today. Uh, in fact, a completely new platform. Uh, it's called the 3DI platform. Uh, can you tell us a little about some of the improvements that you've made to that over the predecessor uh, and some of the uh, other benefits? Yeah. I'm happy to announce that we are launching the new platform of 3D AI SPI, which is the single platform. Mm -hmm. uh, it was fully redesigned from scratch um, and it reaches the high speed. Uh, it's more than 1.7 times faster. Uh, in for the for the standard PCB, so 1.7 times faster than the previous version. Okay. What about the the accuracy levels that you're getting down to? Well, uh, the country uh, is driven by a ball screw with a very high resolution linear scale, uh, so we reach to three micron at uh, six sigma. Okay. As I, that's I think good. that's pretty pretty good. Yeah. So you're taking a sort of quality approach to this. I mean, in fact, you know, you, the the logo that you've got attached to this campaign is is QDP, which is quality driven production. Uh, so, can you tell me what other areas of, of quality that you brought into the into this, into your um, systems? Correct. Uh, we are launching the quality-driven production concept. It is not just focusing on the machine itself, but also on the processes, how to set up the machine, mm -hmm. and how to make sure that the data which are actually measured uh, by by the 3D AOI and SPI are valid and accurate. So it consists of uh, several functionalities from the hardware point of view. For instance, there is a self-diagnostic system which is constantly monitoring the machine conditions. Uh, therefore, we are able to predictively uh, guess what, what, can, what can get wrong or whether the machine is in a stable condition. So that's things like motors, belts, that type of thing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Correct, correct. Uh, so that's a part of preventive and predictive maintenance itself. So actually the machine monitors uh, the accuracy of the gantry. Um, it, it monitors the height reconstruction quality and also all of the lightings in the system. So uh, no, it's, a, it's a fairly new software platform as well, and, and it, they both the software is, is identical on both machines, so the, the machines can talk to each other, both the, the AOI and the AXI. Yeah? Exactly, exactly, uh, correct. So uh, we are having a BF2 series as a software, which is a common platform for all of our 3D products, so starting from SPI through AOI to X-Ray. And uh, by, by this concept of QDP, uh, the software is of course a part of it. So there is a history management system which protects the user from some unintended operation or rollback functionalities. There is a golden and silver sample check, for instance, to make sure that, uh, that the machine is uh, capable to find the right defects uh, on the PCB. And of course, once, once we make sure that all of this environment is correct, uh, then we are sure that the uh, accuracy of the data are sufficient to communicate with a third party, which means internally for Saki, uh, as a, a posting the results to multi-process view to, 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 to show um, to the user how the defect looked at SPI stage, AY or X-ray stage. At the same time, to, to, to export these data uh, to the pick and place machines or another MES systems. So can, can you overlay the, the, the data from the same image, the images from the AOI with the AXI? Absolutely. Uh, the, the only restriction is you have to have a barcode on the PCB. Otherwise, it's a little bit complicated to synchronize the data. Well, it sounds like a lot of developments going on here at Saki. I mean, you, you, you're under new ownership from, I believe, from January. Is that correct? Correct. That's yeah. correct. And has that brought a lot of strength into your R&D department? Absolutely. Uh, we became uh, part uh, of a DMG group, uh, DMG Mori group, um, which which helps us uh, a lot from from the from the company governance point of view. Right. So we have uh, much more resources and a background uh, in the financial uh, matters. Good to see you're putting that to good use. So uh, thank you for joining us today, uh, Yaroslav. Thank you very much, Trevor, for inviting us.